I'm Blake Smith. Welcome to Norton's Engineered for Speed technical section. I'm going to take you through uh, my role in the engineering team here at Dick Johnson Racing today. Here at Dick Johnson Racing I'm in a bit of an all-rounder position at the moment. Uh, we don't have a damper technician so I take a lot of that hands-on role preparing our dampers, bleeding those up. I work with the guys on the car doing setup. Uh, determining those sorts of things and also a little bit of design work as well for all the little bits and pieces we have on the car. So we've just got back from QR so we've had a few new parts on the car this weekend. Part of my job will be going through and identifying if those worked, if they didn't, if we had any failures, anything we need to improve for the next time out at Sydney Motorsport Park. Okay, this is a sneak peek in inside the DJR engineering office. Not many people get to see here, so this is a bit of a privilege. So obviously we've got a few engineers here. We've got data engineers, race engineers for each car. Up in here after a race meeting, we'll go through, process all our pit stop information. Uh, lots of other things like all the data information out of the car, we'll process that. Get all our tyre pressure records, all those sorts of things. We have to keep a tyre bank up here as well, so we manage all that situation. We'll also go through all the setup, what happened on the weekend, driver feedback and then we'll put that together to try and improve for next time. Also, there's also some design work. Things on Car of the Future are also going on in this room at the same time as we're trying to run our current program. So, very busy environment. We're not just up here playing solitaire. There's a lot of hard work going on, despite what some people think. Okay, now I'll uh, run you guys through the damper department here at Dick Johnson Racing. We'll come on in. Here you can see we've got a damper that's come from the race car, uh, just raced on car 18 this weekend. Uh, we've got a spring here also. We use a King spring, which is something that'll transfer over to your uh, road car. You can go down and buy the same technology we run in our V8 supercars, put it in your road car. Great thing. Uh, the normal thing we'll do with the dampers when we get back from the race mini is we'll take them apart, strip them all down, inspect them to see if we've got any damage. We'll also clean them up run them on our damper dyno over here and just make sure all the settings and everything's as it is. If we need to uh, pull them apart and service them, we'll uh, get hands on with that. We don't have a damper technician or a person dedicated to that role here at Dick Johnson Racing, so it's each race engineer's responsibility to go through and service their dampers. So uh, my role this year has been pretty hands on in this department, doing a lot of the work myself and helping out a lot of the, uh, the other engineers getting it done. So obviously it's a small room, you can get fairly busy when you've got all three of us in here. Okay, one of the things we go through when we return from a race meeting is what we call a set down. So obviously help the mechanics out here. They're on their way measuring the wheel alignment, uh, checking out the car. So that we go through that to make sure that during the race anything's been damaged or bent. And also just to confirm where we are with our setup to make sure we know for next time and for the next event that we're exactly spot on. Or to identify if there was any issues with the car which would explain any of the driver comments. Okay, my history in motorsport probably starts from when I was a kid and I probably have to uh, blame my father for all this. Uh, he was uh, well into rallying even before I was born. Uh, I remember watching the old Formula One races when I was growing up as a little kid, or finally being able to stay up to watch them. Uh, we then got into go-karting when I was reasonably young, we did a few years of go-karting, went into Formula Ford. Uh, by that time I was in university, didn't quite have enough money to go racing, so decided I'd best if I can get a job there, get paid to do what I love. Uh, I've worked overseas in America in IndyCar racing. I then came back, uh, joined Stone Brothers Racing after that. Uh, then came across to Dick Johnson Racing in 2010, which was a pretty special year. I was data engineer here that, at that point in time. We managed to win the championship, which was a pretty special time. Uh, last year, I was actually on the 49 car as well over at Paul Morris Motorsport. So that relationship has continued. We've transferred across over to here at uh, Dick Johnson Racing again. So it's sort of coming back home a little bit for me here. Where do you keep your important stuff? Here, definitely, but also here, and here, and probably here too. Of course, having all your stuff with you everywhere you go is fantastic, until you start thinking about how you're going to keep it all safe. Because bad guys really don't care whether they get your credit card number by hacking into one of your computers over the internet, or by simply walking away with your smartphone or tablet when you're not looking. That's why Norton combines protection for your PC, Mac, smartphone and tablet into one powerful package. With Norton, you can quickly protect your devices from all kinds of online threats. 
You can also scan your emails and instant messages for digital dangers, block bogus websites and apps, and keep your personal information away from prying eyes. Plus, if your smartphone or tablet gets lost or stolen, you can lock, track and locate it remotely, right from another computer or phone. Best of all, you can take charge of all this powerful protection from one convenient cloud-based Norton account. Just log in to add your computers, smartphones and tablets and enjoy the peace of mind that comes from knowing all your stuff is safe and protected. So get Norton today and get the powerful protection your stuff deserves, no matter where you keep it or how you choose to use it.